All right, guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to use the DJI Action 5 Pro as a webcam for live streaming. Now, there are two ways of actually doing this, and I'm going to show you both ways. The first one is actually, which is super cool, is to connect the DJI Action 5 Pro to the computer directly using a USB cable. In fact, right now I have a USB cable, which is a USB type C. Now, if you go on this side right here on the DJI, if I can show you a little quick. So if you look on the side here, this is where there's a USB port for the DJI Action 5. Okay, and that's where we're going to plug the USB Type-C. Actually, that's the only connection slash port that you have on the this camera. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to take a normal USB cable, just a normal USB Type-C cable, and we're going to connect it directly into the DJI Action 5 Pro. Okay. Now, once you connect it, it's going to start charging and it may display something that, you know, that will look like this. All right. It's just because it's charging and it's not turned on. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and actually turn it on. And as you can see right now, it's turned on and it's going to ask you if you want to use it as a webcam or if you want to use it as a file transfer or if you want to use it as something else. I can't remember. So you have to choose. You have to pick quickly because if you don't, you're going to lose the screen. So I'm going to go ahead and try it again all right so you have to go fast fast and choose webcam as an option all right so it's kind of hard to show you guys the screen but the screen right now you say webcam and it will say 1080 30 all right so that's good don't need to do much okay and what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna go ahead and so mount it somewhere right now it's mounted in front of me i can just show you what it looks like all right again there's so many ways to mount it depending on how you want to mount it the idea is just to make sure it's mounted where you want it to be maybe in front of you and then once you're done what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to obs and we're gonna go ahead and add it so let's go ahead and open obs by the way my name is sam you're watching the production tips and tools if you're enjoying this content so far make sure you subscribe especially if you are into live streaming all right so as you can see i have obs open right now and i'm gonna go under sources hit the plus sign and add a new video capture device and i'm gonna call it dji action and i'm gonna click ok under device, I'm going to go ahead and choose Osmo Action 5 Pro. That's what it's going to say. And as you can see, we have an image and what I can do, I can go ahead and choose resolution type. I can make it custom. And then as you can see, you have 1920, 1080 and 1280 by 720. Obviously, we want to make sure we take the highest FPS. We can get choose 30 frames per second. Everything else, we can leave it the way it is. And as you can see, we have our DJI Action 5 Pro showing up in OBS as a webcam. Again, guys, you don't have to install any plugin or any driver or anything. It just connects directly to your computer using USB. And as you can see, it's showing up as a webcam. Now, another way of doing it would be by using an HDMI cable and possibly connecting it to a capture card or a video a switcher where you can add many other cameras. Maybe that's why you want to do right because with just a webcam it will just give you one feed and you can't keep adding more usb cameras or you want to do a multi-camera production you really need to use hdmi and use something like a video switcher and to do that it's actually possible with the action 5 pro obviously and if you want to know how to do it i'm gonna make another video and i'm gonna link it right here so make sure you check it out and i'll see you there guys